This is a collection of leads that I've collected on the big ball range when we're shooting at the steel silhouette animals at a range of 200 yards. Um, the projectiles vary that we use. I reload the different sizes. We've got 38s, which is a slightly smaller case, and a 357, which is that one. I use a 200 grain lead projectile. They come in different types, they have different coatings on them, most of them are Teflon, Teflon coating, or they use um, gas checks which is a little brass ring, a little cap underneath the lead itself. It just stops the lead from melting up the bore and it scrapes the bore a little bit cleaner. Um, they're wax rings in them. Um, this is one of the blue 200 grainers that's deflected like that um, we use copper jacketed projectiles as well that's a copper jacketed jacket projectile you can see how much that's squashed out um, 
a lot of them hit with so much force, all that's left is the jacket itself. These ones here just show how much force it is hitting those animals to squash it into a one cent piece. The rest of the lead just explodes and disintegrates. Now you can see by this one here, uh, it just absolutely um, flattens the leads, and yet they're a very heavy, a heavy 200 grain. Uh, I'm now using these, a 185 grain, seems to go a little bit further. They're just Teflon coated. Um, the amount of powder difference between these leads here are target leads for shooting at the paper targets. That one, that one and that one have actually been fired. You can see they're holding, completely holding their shape. That's only at 25 yards. They just come out of the gun and cut a hole in the target and then drop. Um, it, we use 38 cases for those. This is the difference in the powder. Um, that's how much powder goes into a target load. And this is how much is in a in a big bore load. You can see the difference between the two there. For paper loads, we use two grains of powder. For big bore metallic silhouette, I use 14 and a half grains of powder. Um, and the result is a big difference between say that's a small lead from that to that these jacketed bullets squash up pretty well the metallic silhouette animals we shoot at can be up to half an inch thick and half a meter high on average um, at 200 yards the leads absolutely crush like they've been hit with a sledgehammer you end up after five five shoots you can see the damage that happens to the cases they just split straight up the center they start off with very small splits right just at the tip there and the worst is right down the bottom to the bottom of the case the pressure is enormous the guns usually are 357 Magnum Smith & Westerns or Ruger um, yeah so that's basically it. Um, the difference in a metallic silhouette load is enormous compared to a target load.